Hello everyone, Fred here with Card Dealer Pro, and in this video, we're gonna run you through how to add advertising banners and watermarks to your card images inside the Card Dealer Pro web app. Now this just happens to be one of my favorite features, um, something that we've had in the desktop software for quite a while now, um, but something I was very eager to get added for those customers that just use the web app. So to run you through in this demonstration, uh, we're gonna assume you already have your batches uploaded. We're not gonna run through how to upload cards and document them and all of that. We do have how-to videos on how to create a batch, upload your cards, let us auto-document them, etc. So I highly encourage you to check out the other how-to videos. But for the sake of this demonstration, we're just gonna jump into a batch we already have. So we're gonna navigate over to the batches screen by clicking on batches in the menu on the left. And we have a batch here called add a banner that we've set up for this purpose. Now, before we go in to add the banner to this batch, the one thing that you need to set up within your profile or your settings is the banner that you want to place on the card as well as where you want to place it. So we're going to navigate to our settings. We're going to scroll down until we see the banner section. Now to begin, we need to add a banner to add to these cards. So I'm going to go ahead, open this up and then choose a banner that I've already created. Click open. So this is the banner that we want to add to all of my card images. I go ahead and hit upload. And we get a success message up in the corner. I close this. Now down below, you need to ensure that this checkbox here, add banner to card images is selected. And then you need to choose if you want that on the top or if you want that added to the bottom. So I wanna add the banner to cards. I have my banner selected and I wanna add it to the bottom. I'm gonna go ahead and click Save Changes and I get the success message up here in the right corner. Once this is saved, you don't need to come back and do this again. This is just with the first time that you're going through the process, you need to set these settings. Now that we have these set, I'm gonna go back to my batches and I'm gonna open up this batch of cards. So this is currently how the cards look. If I click in on these and zoom in, you can see we have nice high-res images from our fantastic Fujitsu auto feed scanner. Um, but I wanna add a banner to these to have them stand out on eBay and to draw more attention to my listings over my competitors. So what I'm gonna do is back at the batch screen, I'm going to click up here on these three little dots to open up the additional menu. I get three options, remove batch, change batch status to closed, or add banner to cards. All I have to do is click on that. It'll take a couple of seconds and then we'll get a confirmation up here in the upper right corner like we always do that it's in process. So over on the left, we now see that the process has completed. If we click back on this batch, we now notice that all of these card images have the banner added. So if I click on these and zoom in and look at that card that we just looked at, I now have this nice banner that continues with my nice bold black borders that I got from my Fujitsu Auto Feed Scanner that now shows up on the card. So these are all branded now with my logo, advertising that I do combine shipping and encouraging my buyers on eBay to come and buy more cards. So very quick, easy way to quickly brand all of your cards. Now, this particular batch had five cards in it. You could do this with a batch that has five or 50 or 500 or 5,000. Um, it might take a little bit longer to process the more cards you have, um, but it's less than a one second per card. You also get an email notification when that process is done and completed, so you know when all of those banner images have been added to your card images. So very straightforward, very easy way to market your cards, market your shop, and get your logo and your name out there. So hopefully you like this feature. If you have any ideas or suggestions on how we could make this better, we would love to hear from you. Um, any feedback that you have on anything within Card Dealer Pro, we're always eager to hear. Please check out all of our other how-to videos and tutorials in the uh, support and help section. Otherwise, if you ever need assistance and you want to get in touch with us, in the bottom right corner of every one of these pages is our support link. Click on that to open up the form to get in touch with us. This will send us a message. You can set up a one-on-one -on -one call for support. Um, we can do a personalized demonstration. We can troubleshoot anything you have going on. We're always here to help, so if you ever need anything, please do not hesitate to use that to get in touch with us. So thank you for taking the time to watch how we add banner images to cards in Card Dealer Pro. Happy collecting.